change, no way, no way. You are the same from the day that I knew that I could love you when I saw your face. My life was changed. You were the world. Diamonds just can't capture you, girl. No way. It is Sunday morning. So happy Sunday to you guys. When I initially filmed this video, I want to say it was Friday because the kids had got paid and we had to go out and pay bills and do the actual shopping. Yesterday, I was sick. When I say sick, you guys, like, yeah. I was bad, bad. Yeah, I got dizzy. I'm talking about, like, like whoa, like it knocked me off my feet dizzy. So... And I ended up falling in the bathroom. I ain't tell nobody. I'm saying this is the first time anybody hearing. So I ain't tell mama, the kids, Jordan, nobody. So I ended up falling in the bathroom. And I got up. And I went and sat on my bed. I didn't hurt anything. And I was like, oh, Lord. So I had took my heart medicine. And I already had took my thyroid medicine. But I had took my heart medicine because my chest started hurting. So I was just sitting on the edge of the bed. And I was drinking some water. So I was able to get enough strength. I got up and fix me some ice and then I poured my water and my ice and I'm drinking some ice water and it felt like I got hotter instead of getting cooler I was getting more hot and Jordan had called me and I was talking to him on the phone I was telling him I wasn't feeling well and I guess he heard it in my voice and I was like babe I'm just you know I'm finna just go take me a cold shower or you know like a cool bath or a cold shower and you know try to see what's going on and he was like, okay, where's your blood pressure up? And I didn't take my blood pressure at that moment. But I was like, I just need to cool down. Because it felt like my body was burning up from the inside out. I was shaking real bad. And I'm like, oh, my God. But it wasn't like I wasn't coughing, wasn't sneezing, or none of that. So I wasn't thinking nothing, corona, nothing. It was just like, okay, it's my thyroid level. Because I know how my lupus get. So it wasn't a lupus flare. So I knew it was my thyroid level. And I'm like, Lord have mercy. I have not had any issues with my thyroid level since October. So I'm like, okay, this is not the time for my thyroid level to start going out of whack. And my fever was 102.7. And I sent, I screenshot it and I sent it to him on Snap. And he was like, that's your fever? I said, yeah. So I was like, I'm, I'm finna go take me a cold shower. <laughs> it went from cool to cold. I was like, I'm gonna take me a cold shower. So... I went on and took the shower, and I felt like my body started cooling down and everything. So, I was like, okay. And then, I got back on the bed. I took my temperature again, and my temperature went down to, it was like 100.7. So, it dropped two points, you know. And, and I took my blood pressure, and my blood pressure was 100. It was 192 over, I think, and I wrote it down, it was 192 over 90 and i'm like dang i'm like okay i took a blood pressure pill and i kept telling Riri. i knew it was something because i my headache like my head felt like it was gonna bust it was hurting in the back at the top and the front like my whole head felt like it was just gonna explode and she was like well do you want to go to the hospital i said no i don't want to go to nobody's hospital because they're not keeping me i'll be okay i had all my medicine so i'm like let me just take the rest of my medicine and so I laid across the bed and I was just laying there <laughs> and I was praying like, Lord, just let my, let me cool down. Cause it's like, I was, when I say I was burning up and my head was hurting, I was shaking. Like I just, it was bad. So then I ended up just laying there. We, I had put the air conditioner on 62 and I know they probably was cold, but I was burning up and I had just got undressed and got under my covers. So, probably about, and that was about, what, 9, about 10 o'clock? That was about 10 o'clock. By the time I got back in my bed, I stayed in my bed from 10 o'clock to 6 o'clock yesterday. I didn't get out of my bed other than to go to the bathroom, and I got right back in my bed. The kids was bringing me ice and stuff. So, Mama had took Riri to the dollar store, and around there when they got me some Tylenol, the extra strength Tylenol, because I was like, I was either going to take a Demerol, uh, Vicodin, because I needed my head to stop. But if I took a Demerol, I would have been out all yesterday. And I didn't want to have all that in my system. So she, I took two extra strength Tylenol, and that was about 2 o'clock. So mind you, all this started around 9.30. 
So about two o'clock, I took two extra shrimp Tylenol because I'm one of them. If I don't have to take medicine, I don't. I like to just let it naturally go away. Everything I was trying, my fever had broke, but my head was still hurting. So I'm like, okay. So 2.30 passed, 3 o'clock passed, 4, 5, about 5.45, my headache finally just went away. I started feeling better, and I was like, thank you, Lord, because that whole time, all I was doing was praying. Because I'm like, for one, if it's my time to go, I'm ready. For two, I'm not going to sit in nobody's hospital. I knew those two things was a must. Yeah, this joint will come. All right, you guys. A few hours have passed. I had to go take care of some stuff. Had to run around. I had to go run to the um, store because she's not feeling well. She had to go get her some um, pineapple juice and stuff and some bananas because her potassium is dropping. And she do have potassium pills, but it's certain things she got to drink in addition to it. So we ran and got that. Came home. Mama just got finished cooking, so I'm going to share her dinner with y'all. All right, this is her barbecue chicken. She did some macaroni and cheese, the shell. These are the, um, I think the Velveeta ones. Yeah, those are the Velveeta ones. And then she did some baked beans and corn. Oh, and she did some corn. This was the frozen corn. Um, yeah, this was the frozen corn that she did. So that is our dinner for today. Hey guys, how are you all doing? Welcome back to our channel. I hope everybody is doing well. We are praying for everyone, everywhere. Y'all stay safe. Please always stay prayed up. Keep your families as safe as possible. Do what you need to do to get through this. Um, I know a lot of people are stressed out, going through stuff. We know different. Our families know different. But we just make the best out of the situation we laugh together even when things get rough y'all see our video even when things get rough and tough and we got days that we tired of each other and we sick of all being in this house together i just start recording you know so that's why i i thank the lord that i can record all these moments because you never know from day to day we don't know what's going to happen a couple of months ago we didn't think this was happening a few months ago we didn't know we was going to be here definitely not a year ago last year we was talking about when the government went on strike and people was trying to figure out if they was going to work. You know what I mean? So it's like you don't know what's going to be. But you can go back and you can thank the Lord. You can thank God. You can have your faith be in your peace and know that at the end of the day, you got to remain in your faith and you know he got you. He got you because you live and you above ground. You got shelter. You got food. Your bills are paid. And if they're not paid, keep on praying. Just keep on praying, and it's going to be. I promise you it's going to be. It's going to be. Make sure y'all hit that thumbs up button. Please like our video. It helps us out a whole, whole lot to get our videos in circulation and supporting each other. Because right now, we all need that. We all need to support each other, no matter what. So please make sure y'all hit the thumbs up button. Before you leave, if you want, you can click out this video right now. Hit the button and come back in. Um... Make sure you always like our videos all the time. Please do not forget y'all. I cannot stress. I know y'all tired of seeing me flashing it on the screen. But I cannot tell you guys how important it is to like our videos. It, YouTube know that y'all like it and y'all watching them. They see the views, but they want to know that y'all liking what we putting up. I bought you some cupcakes, grapes, and all that. So we are finna go ahead on and get into this video. I spent... I think the total was like 159 or 157 and some change. My daughter Alicia paid for her stuff separate. And I told you, I'm a, I told you guys what her stuff was because I'm actually recording this before, after I Hey, life ain't perfect. Um, so, yeah, but we, we do love you guys. If I forget to tell you guys that at the end of the video, I love you all. We are always praying for you all. Just stay blessed, okay, y'all? Let's get into this video. Mama! Hey, guys. What's going on? Welcome back to our channel. Welcome back to the crew. Hope you guys are all doing well, staying safe, being blessed. We just got back from Walmart because we found out the other day that our city is kind of like finally starting to do the lockdown. It started at 5 o'clock today. It's 5.26 and we just got in the house. Um, and it's still kind of like guidelines on certain things you can or cannot do. You can go walking, but you got to be within your area. Um, 
parks, beaches, everything else is closed. You can go to the store. Um, you know, we just go to the store, get what you gotta get, go home. So yeah. But we wouldn't have got this stuff. I probably won't have to go back probably for about two weeks until I gotta go get some more milk and bread or whatever. We can kind of find as we can find, but as far as meat products, I really didn't need any because we stocked up. But I finally got some more eggs because the last couple of times I've been going to the store, they have not had any. And I just got two 18 counts because I didn't want to get three and four. Because as I said before, you know, other people still got to get stuff. So I just got two 18 counts because we don't just eat eggs every single day. I got me a thing of the Chips Ahoy Chunky and the pinwheels. Y'all know I love these pinwheels. The girl had accidentally turned over some of my cupcakes, but it was okay because this was the only pack that they had that was all vanilla. The rest of them was like vanilla and chocolate, and Philip not going to eat the chocolate ones. I got one gallon of milk because we still had two and a half gallons in there, I think. I got these from Dollar General, some cups, because I forgot to get the cups out of Walmart, and I was not going back in Walmart. I just got two things of butter from the dollar store because Walmart was out of this butter. And I think I still had like four more in the freezer. I just picked up two more. And then Philip had needed some more of these. I had bought a big pack probably about a month and a half ago. I thought he still had some in there. But I think somebody else been kind of drinking on them. So that's okay. So I got, and these have what, six a piece. So I got the Cherry Starburst. The all pink, the blue raspberry, the pineapple sun kiss, and the strawberry sun kiss. And he won't just drink all of them up. I got one more case of water because we still had some water. Um, we're gonna start over here. Uh, I think these are rounds. Hey, rounds I picked her up a thing of the, the Eggo thick and fluffy French toast. I got one fanta for Deontay because he asked me to pick him up a fanta. I got a fa strawberry fanta for him and a Canadian dry ginger ale with lemon for me. I needed another thing of um, dish detergent. I got the pink, the um, salmon because I will just, you know, randomly make me some of these. I don't know which one of them picked those up. I think Reante and she got some oatmeal, the maple brown sugar. I got four more packs of taco seasoning. For when I do tacos, I pick these up for Deontay. We got some turkey, the Sara Lee. They was out of the spice and luncheon meat. That's what Reante wanted, but they was out of it. So she, we just picked this up. I find I got some more. Um, well, I finally found some camellias because y'all know I haven't been able to find them. So I picked up two packs. Um, and I got some of the other blue runner beans, so that was fine. And I picked up a pack of potatoes. I got one thing of juice. I didn't say the Fruit Loops, did I? I got Philip a thing of Fruit Loops. I picked up one thing of juice, one thing of hot sauce, two of these juices for Philip, the Tropical Punch, and the Berry Blue. I got a thing of extra virgin olive oil because I do like to put that in my water when I take my bath at night. I'll put like a cap full or a cap and a half. My Weber's Kicking Chicken. I was out and I needed some. I was looking for the French fry seasoning, but I could not find any there or in Dollar General. So I'm going to have to go to Dollar Tree. They usually don't want to have it when no one else does. I got another thing of Easy Cheese because Philip and Deontay eats this up. I finally found me a thing of Mrs. Butterworth because they've been out of it of late. So I finally found me one. Plus, I still got the Angel Mama. One thing of... I got one thing of the Sweet Heat Golden Flakes, and Alicia got her one. Y'all will see hers in a second. I got one of the original lemonades. This stuff right here is for Alicia. She got a white cran strawberry. She got her some steak fries. Walmart was completely out of fries. I think they had like one small little bag, one small bag left. But she got these from Dollar General. They had no steak fries. Then she got her a thing of the spicy pork sausage, her chips. Um, uh, what's this? A chocolate mousse. A thing of chili, no beans. She got her Reese that she ate one. She got her some propel. <laughs> she well, they can see you ate it. She got a papaya passion candle, a Caesar salad with chicken and bacon. And she picked up one. It had looked nasty. All of them looked like that except for that one. So mm. I gotta eat that today. And then she got her Ghirardelli the um, brownies. Parades. Oh, you got parades? No. Oh, these must be round tape parades. I got a thing of orange juice, and I was glad they had the boarding because I love either the boarding or the mini maid. 
I got the Arizona watermelon, a Hawaiian punch, the blueberry typhoon, the boat parallel, <laughs> polar blast. I found some tuna fish. I got the big cans, and they was like, "That's the chunk light." I say it's okay. Alicia said you wasn't saying that about your syrup, and I'm gonna tell y'all why. But first, I got four cans, four of the big cans of the chunk light, cause we still had some tuna in there, and I got just one regular thing of mayo. Before I finish that, let me tell y'all what why I said what I said. The last week I sent Rante in Walmart to get me some syrup. They had the Angel Mama light. That was all that was left. I don't like this. I like the Angel Mama, but I get the extra rich butter syrup or whatever it's called. Or I'll just get the original. But I don't like the original light. Like, it just looks like water. Like, so, Elysian had been eating that. So, yesterday, I actually found me one at Dollar General. And it's the Angel Mama original. So, today, I was lucky enough... <coughs> To find the Mrs. Um, Buttersworth. I got to fill up some grapes, some beefsteak tomatoes, and lettuce for my tacos. When I do a taco um, salad, then I can just run to the dollar store and get some cheese. Because I forgot to pick some up today and Walmart was out. So if I do have to go out tomorrow, I'll just get me some cheese. I got a pineapple. Um, I'm just going to cut it because they charge way too much for their pineapples already cut up. They had no cantaloupes. Um, they had some cut up, but they looked dry. They had no fresh ones. So I'll just wait and hopefully I'll find me some. I got fill up four of the ABC um, one, two, three, the little cups. And then I found him two cans. And I think they have, well, they had four cans. I just got two. And then the other lady got two more. And they had eight of these. And I got four. And the other lady got four. And they had other brands, but that was only with these um, particular ones. Y'all know he liked the ABC. And then I got him the eight pack of Sprites. I found they only had one of the board and whole Dutch chocolate milks. They had the quart, and this was only half a gallon. The rest of them was low fat. Y'all know I don't do the low fat. And then I only got four cans of corn because that's all I needed to stock back up. The five pack of the macaroni and cheese. I'll fix these for Philip one day for something random. And I got a thing of hot dog buns, hamburger buns, the Sara Lee butter bread, and the Texas toast, the Rice Krispies. Because, okay, I'm not going to lie and tell y'all these are for Philip nor the kids because I like these. I put them in my room and I snack on them at night. I will eat two or three and drink me some water. So I'm always going to keep it real with y'all. It's no need to lie. Why lie? For what reason? No purpose. So, got those. What else? Did I go through all this stuff already? It seemed like I spent way more. Let's see. My total came up to one forty nine sixty seven. Um, and I think that was it. Like I said, Alicia paid for her some. Oh, and I got a thing of um the Box root beers. They still have cokes and sprites left. I didn't have to really get too, too much cereal because they still got cereal. But I know Philip did ask me for some Fruit Loops. That's why I got the Fruit Loops. And I still had one thing of the Cran Grape. I was looking for the Cran Pineapple, but they were sold out. And they do I do have one in the refrigerator that I just opened. So, I think that's it, y'all. I got to put laundry up. So, I'm going to let the kids put all this stuff up. And I'm finna take my stuff to the back. But yeah, I'm gonna let them put all the rest of this stuff up. Can y'all come put this up for me, please? If y'all don't mind terribly, you and the lesion. Um, and these I put Phillips stuff in his room. But I think I got everything. If I missed anything, you guys pretty much see it. But I think I got everything, y'all. So yeah. So I definitely thank you guys for watching. Please make sure y'all hit the thumbs up button before y'all leave out. I would def definitely appreciate it. It'll mean so much to us if you guys would do that. So please do not forget. Make sure y'all are subscribed. And if you're not, go ahead on and subscribe. Hit the bell so you will get all of our posts and notifications. We always doing hauls all the time. We, we do hauls often. Even doing all of this, we do hauls. So I will see you guys later. Y'all stay blessed. Love you all.
Hey, what's up, y'all? I'm just sitting outside, just talking to you guys for a few minutes, and I'm going to let y'all go. I ain't going to keep y'all long. Oh, we just got finished eating dinner. It's not really anything else going on that we're going to do today. We're just going to kind of watch TV and chill. I'm starting to get another headache. So I'm about to go ahead and take my blood pressure medicine and a Tylenol. Oh, excuse me. My blood pressure medicine and a Tylenol. And kind of call it a day. I just came out here to get me a little minute of fresh air and some sunlight. Uh, but I am feeling so much better than I was yesterday. So I thank the Lord for that. But other than that, y'all, all we've really been doing is taking care of ourselves, taking it easy, staying inside. You know, y'all saying we'll go out and just kind of walk our block and come back home. But other than that, we haven't been doing anything just like everybody else. Just chilling, taking these, easy, spending time with the family. Praying, staying positive. That's it. It's all you can do. But we will definitely see you guys later. Y'all enjoy y'all day. I do have a video. I have two sit down videos that I will be doing for you guys. One over here on this channel, one over on the other channel. Um, so y'all stay tuned to that. And it's just kind of some things that you know that I've been kind of going just going through dealing with positive stuff. Nothing negative, nothing bad. Um, I guess just kind of my testimony and where I'm at. And then on my other channel, I will be discussing and talking about, you know, my relationship and my next move and what's going to be in marriage and all of that stuff. So you guys definitely stay tuned for that. And anything else you guys would want to see or like for us to talk about, please jot them down in the comment section below. And we will get that done for you guys. So I'll see y'all later.